and I left with only one bag. Mind you, I went with nine bags, nine bags, and I came out with no bags, okay? So that Monday, I met Freezy. I'm gonna link, I'm gonna link his um, Instagram down below. He is a marketing professional, and I met him because, you know, we talked before on Instagram, but I met him because I wanted, I wanted to see what his program was about, and I wanted to talk to him, you know, network and things like that. And I was surprised because we shared the same thing. Like, his likes are my likes, and he's into the same thing that I'm into. So, I'm, I'm really, um, I like a quote that he always says, if you're successful, I'm successful as well. So why not help each other and network? So I'm going to leave his Instagram down below so you can go follow him and support him and find some clients for him. Like, why not? So that was that on Monday. And with him, I remember that I went to give business cards and things like that. And New York wasn't accepting that Lily's luxury that, that day. Like, everybody was just money. I guess it was Monday. They needed some motivation on Monday from me. But whatever. I did not get discouraged because by that time, I had eight bags sold, including lashes and glosses. So I was like, yo, I made my money. I made my profit for this um for this time. And mind you, I bought my ticket, my men's ticket, my 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 daughter's ticket, and my mother-in-law's ticket. So it wasn't just my ticket. I bought those tickets. So I'm like, whatever. Like I made back my profit. I'm not losing. I'm going back with money in my pocket. I made the fly uh, money, everything. So that day I went home, you know, recharged my energy. On Tuesday morning, I went out and that bag got sold out. Say it again, say it again. Uh, you need to be in the stock market selling stocks. Why? <laughs> because you don't miss nothing. Ah, you see, you see. I'm here in the Bronx, you heard. In the Bronx, in New York even on the basketball court. So if you don't want to come to New York, look out Miami, cause she coming and okay. you gonna be running to her because she got it for you, even if you want her. So, okay. call her. You wanna call me? I've been here since Thursday, but I'm living today, okay? And I have one bag left out of nine, and this is gonna sell today. See. Hablo español, parlo francés, pregunté de ni alma, ani asa se o conichiwa, regresé en Tijuana, Shabbat Shalom, Assalamu alaikum, wait a minute, wait, R A I N A S L, American Sign Language, but in all languages we got it. Okay, my product. Okay, in all language. Okay, he told you. Uh, where we at? So they can know that they can come here and shop your products. What's the address? New York. But what's the address? 235 on Broadway. 235 on Broadway, okay? No. 231 on Broadway. Mejor. Okay. Español. <laughs> 231 and Broadway. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, see you. Hola, suave. Take my business. Vale, France, oui, oui. And don't forget, call me. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so, I got this guy, and he's helping me. What? What you helping me for? Probably a little couple, little, little couple of dollars and everything, but I'm just, this lady is so beautiful. Let me see there. your business cards. The business cards. So he's helping Luxury. me give the business cards. Darn. And I'm gonna give him something. But he has to sell my glasses and everything. So go, let's get to work, okay? Let's get that, let's get that bread, baby. No, okay, no. okay. So tell me how you will talk to people. How I will talk to people, like saying like how this how this beautiful girl is. I feel like oh my this look like this color right here, purple. Something, something, something light like that. I ain't gonna tell all my details like that, but no, I know how to talk to females. But certain colors bring out, bring out the beauty in a female. But you got one hour and you had to sell the glosses, so that tells me <laughs> yeah, that you're not a salesperson. Hours. It hasn't been one hour. It has to 
you gave me the cards. I got the cards off. I'm walking around, trying to get, this, trying to get these off. But certain people, it's like, okay, I don't want to walk the but people be an asshole trying to get everything. Okay, so let me get to work because this is my last day here and I need to do it, okay? Last day. Last day here. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Last day here. Okay, let's get to work. ¿Cómo yo me veo? Sí, pero ¿tú entiendes lo que yo le digo? Ve, ve, pues no me digas que mis lashes están ugly. Ay, Dios mío, usted no la conoce, ¿no? No, que no la conoce. ¿Cuál iglesia va? Ay, Dios mío. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Oh, my God. This nigga, he was telling me that my lashes were ugly, that my lashes were too much. I'm like, thank you, I appreciate your opinion, but he kept going. I'm like, yo, like, it is my personal opinion, and on top of that, the, the longer lashes are the one that sells more. And he just kept going and going. He was rude, but I really don't give a fuck. I have no filter. Like, okay, I appreciate your opinion. It's your opinion. You're entitled to it, but I don't care. Like, do I seem that I care? I don't care. I'm not gonna lose sleep about it, but whatever. And then he was telling me, oh my God, you look so cute. I was just messing with you. I don't care. I look popping anyways, okay? So let me just keep continue to give my business card out here. Okay. Okay. It's early, so in this side there's not many people. But whatever. We're gonna make it work. And I remember that I met this girl that she was like, yo, hit me up. I'm gonna hook you up. She's like the governor of Manhattan. She's Dominican. That's what she says. And I, I went live. She was live. And she had over 170 live viewers. And yo, she gave me promotion there and I started talking to them. And I don't know if they subscribed or started following me. I don't know, but you know, at least, okay, at least. Por qué no? Por qué no lo puedes hacer tú en la patria? Por qué no lo puedes hacer tú en este país? Por qué si tienes aspiraciones, lamentablemente tus talentos tienen que ser maltratados y subyugados? Por qué ustedes los dominicanos no reconocen que estamos siendo dirigidos por personas las cuales no tienen la capacidad ni el sentimiento patriótico. Tenemos que luchar, tenemos que buscar la forma de salir adelante apoyando jóvenes como esta joven. ¡Esto! El vato está ready, eso es el high five. Y Alfie dijo, mira, Alfie dijo. a la persona mía de YouTube, ¿quién es usted? Mi nombre es Aura Marrero, soy directora general de la campaña Ramfis 2020 y soy una aspirante a lo que es, agárrenme aquí para que, que se vea lo que yo estoy diciendo, para que usted nos enseñe a nosotras. La eh, soy precandidata para la Diputación de Ultramar, estoy luchando por jóvenes como ellas, estoy luchando por los dominicanos aquí, los cuales hasta ahora han sido maltratados, subyugados, abusados, ignorados. Nosotros necesitamos gente que nos representen aquí en el Senado, la candidatura, necesitamos jóvenes valientes y mis aspiraciones, mis aspiraciones como líder en este partido es que jóvenes como ella, dentro de algunos 12, 8 años, 12 años, 16 años, puedan ocupar la presidencia en la República Dominicana. ¿Por qué no? ¿Por qué tú no? ¿Por qué no puedes si tú eres un joven inteligente? Si tú eres un hombre dominicano patriota, tú eres una joven. Ahora mismo estamos incursionando en que la mujer está enseñando tu potencial, su poderío. Nosotras las mujeres podemos. Tenemos pantalones, sabemos levantarnos a cualquier hora, sabemos hacer mezcla, sabemos hacer de todo. Entonces, ¿por qué tenemos que dejarnos un lugar? No. Que Ramfi es un hombre de palabra y que Ramfi va a cumplir. Ya usted sabe, mi gente, Ramfi a la presidencia. A la presidencia, eso. Y Darilis. Dígale eso. Y tenemos aquí a Darilis, el futuro de nuestra patria. Próxima presidenta en el 2017. ¿Cómo es? En el 2034. En el 2034. Eso, sí, porque si no me lo visita. Lo que, señores, vamos a poner Vamos a entender que Dios es nuestro guía, Aura Marrero, próxima diputada de Ultramar, aquí en los Estados Unidos, representando a todos los dominicanos. ¡Eh! Y Rafi, vente, vente, presidente. Ya lo saben, ya lo saben. Gracias, Michu. 
So look at this baby. I've seen her three times. I just find her here. Look. Do you have my lashes? Yeah. So she got my lashes. So follow her. What's her Instagram? Um, Oma, um, Rajita Bajo Glade. So you already know. I'm gonna put it down in the link below. Look, my clothes that it is luxury. Okay. Know your love that it is luxury. So you already know. See you soon, baby. So that was it. That was my trip. I left um, New York on Tuesday. So I'm on my way home. <laughs> and I will say that my trip was really successful because I made everything that I wanted. I sold all my bags. I have bags for $40, $50. was the minimum of my bags. So that was only in bags. Imagine lashes. I sold a lot of my lashes that I brought with me and all my glosses too. So I've been sold down of glosses and bags for the, the past two weeks. That's another mistake that I'm going to talk in another, another of my videos because you should never let your inventory go to zero. Never. Because I've been stopped and I have orders there that I, I hadn't processed because I don't have lip gloss. Okay, I need to make them and I'm waiting for the tubes. But whatever. So that being said, thank you so much for watching. Thank you everybody that supported that it is luxury in New York. I really will say that I'm going to go back there pretty soon because I really liked it. I formed new friendships. I networked. So thank you so much for everybody that supported me. Thank you so much for watching this. I really appreciate you, honey. Okay? Okay. So like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on my next video. My next episode is going to be episode number five. See you next time. That is babe. Love you. Spread the love.